it really does feel softer than what it usually feels like and that's just crazy that's so crazy hey guys and welcome back to my channel so in today's video i am doing a natural hair experiment so um i haven't seen this video done before so i'm going to see if it makes my hair softer to heat up my um cream moisturizer in the loc method like to actually heat up heat up, to actually heat it up in the microwave to see if it actually like makes my hair softer because i saw this on instagram somewhere like it was a post that was like um to make your hair softer you want to heat up your deep conditioner i'm gonna try it with my um cream conditioner or cream moisturizer sorry and you guys the moisturizer that i'm using is this tgin buttercream you guys this conditioner or why do i keep calling it a conditioner this moisturizer leaves my hair soft for days like everybody who commented down below on one of my previous videos telling me to try this thank you so much this product is everything and more guys like because usually i struggle with having really 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 dry hair but after i started using that product my hair just be super soft so i'm starting off with freshly washed hair yes i know it looks crazy but what i'm going to do is i'm just gonna do like a light um i look so crazy like twist just sticking all types of ways i'm gonna do a light wash and go which means i'm not really gonna use a lot of gel or anything i'm really just gonna focus on using a lot of moisturizer because i want my hair to really be moisturized so i actually made a homemade leave-in conditioner as well um with pretty much ingredients that i feel like everybody in their house everybody has in their house already so i made a homemade leave-in conditioner and what i'm gonna do is just go ahead and spray this in my hair and also if you guys it smells very sweet, but it tastes kind of sweet too because I put honey in it. It kind of got in my mouth. Anyways, if you guys want a um, tutorial on how I made this, just comment down below that you want to see it. And I will go ahead and do that for you guys. It's going to be a quick tutorial because it, really, it was really simple to make. So, I'm going to go ahead and work that in my hair. My hair is already detangled, by the way, which is amazing. Like, y'all... If you watch my channel, you know that I hate using like brushes and combs, but I just recently started using them and I don't know why I have not been using them this whole time. I think it was because I was tender headed, but pff, yo, having like detangled hair and like being able to kind of run your fingers through your hair, it's like so amazing. Anyway, so um, as my leave-in conditioner, I showed you guys, I used a homemade leave-in conditioner um, and I did say I'm using a the LOC method so that was my leave-in I'm using extra virgin olive oil as my oil so I'm gonna go ahead and just get a little bit of that like about this much because I don't have much in the bottle as you can see but I'm gonna go ahead and work that into my hair as well and like I said I'm just doing a light microwave for about 30 seconds and it did not melt like it didn't melt at all this stuff is super thick like when I say it did not melt at all I am so shocked that it held its form and it was in there for a while because when I pulled it out it was a little it was kind of steaming because I was expecting for it to melt but it did not melt at all so I'm going to put that and for the gel that I'm using y'all know how it is when you get to the bottom of your hair hair products and you're just trying to like use them up argan oil eco stellar gel in the back of my hair let me start off with the praying hands method i'm just gonna put this in there like so but i'm really not expecting a super duper amount of So I'm just kind of putting this in there just to get some type of um, texture to my hair.
I'll probably come back to you guys later tonight when my hair is dry. Of you.